what's up you guys welcome back to my youtube channel and in case it's your first time coming across this face karibu sana my name is mashi pay i create content on lifestyle and travel in case you are a returning subscriber thank you so much for coming back i really really appreciate it i see your love and i'm so grateful about it so today you guys from the title you already know we are filming a house tour i'm so excited about this specific video but i was a little bit skeptical about filming it I wasn't sure if I wanted to really show out my space but again you guys are family and you people have really requested that I actually do it and I was like why not it wouldn't do me any harm to actually film this specific video so you guys stay tuned and I will leave all the details of um, uh, anything that I think that maybe you guys deserve to know or anything that I think you people will probably inquire about on the description box and I'll also remember to actually mention it. The reason why I'm saying this is because I've actually, I, I love to watch house tours. I really love to watch house tours and I usually see people really inquiring about something one or two and to avoid this I'm really just trying to make sure that I update you guys. So yeah, let's do this something quick the reason why i also decided to actually do a house tour is because i am thinking of flipping my space to a whole new thing um i'm kind of satisfied with my space but i feel that i feel like there are a little bit of changes that i really need to do i think i would have actually done them before but you know financial issues and time everything and then trying to really find what you love and want they all take time but i feel with time i'm going to actually change the entire situation so i'm also going to let you guys know what we are going to retain and what we are going to do away with so yeah that was what i wanted to quickly mention so that you guys don't wonder why i'm actually telling you guys um what we are going to do away with and what we are going to retain so that basically means that we also have an updated house tour after we do a maybe makeover not like an entire makeover but some mini makeovers to specific places so also stay tuned for that specific specific video and i'm so excited to actually do them <laughs> ah that was <laughs> You guys, the reason why I'm laughing is because I just remembered a word that my friend Jana Alingoa. Now, manze, ay, nilisha, nilisha. And I know they are going to watch this. Ata si moja, wawili. I know they are actually going to watch this and staki kuambia yo jina. Because, ay, ay, mtaisha, bro. <laughs> that was funny. Like, that was funny. I, I laughed my ribs out and wali nijangia siku. So, yeah, let's do it. So you guys, this is the main door, like this one, we have like two doors. So that is the main door when you are actually like coming in and then we have an entire washing area here that I'm going to show you guys at the end of the video. So you come in straight from there and you tell um, in here like that's another door. So this is like the inside door and then you walk all the way. Yeah, those are my indoor shoes. I got them from Instagram, some page, I don't know, it's called Gallies J.O. something. I don't know how to mention it. And then that's my bedroom that I'm going to show you guys also. And then on this side is my bathroom, stroke my uh, toilet area. And uh, this house has some kind of weird arrangement, honestly. It has some kind of weird arrangement that I didn't really like from the start, but I think I'm actually used to it right now. And then, so we're from there. That's the out the second door, and then my bedroom, and then my washroom area. And then, so when you like move from that's my bedroom, and then when we go in here, it's my sitting room. So we're going to start from the sitting room immediately you walk in like this is the door like this is the sitting room door and i really appreciate the gray color that is going on in here first thing you come across is this um what do you call these things is that is it a system okay let's just say it's a system and then uh this one i bought it from some place in luzuli avenue i was recommended to them by someone actually someone had the same one and i loved it and i asked them I asked them where they got it and they recommended me to their guy. So far, I like it. Uh, it really doesn't have any issues. And then 
on that area is my study table this is where i do all my work from this is where i what do we say what do we say i study from and then i have my laptop here some notebook remote key and then when you move like to this side we have those plants you guys have a few people actually watched the plants video this plant i got it for 30 bob 30 kenyan shillings you guys i am your plug please go and watch that video if i remember i will attach the link it will pop like on top of as you continue to watch this video so that is the plan that we got for that bob and then i also have a chair that i usually read with i'll show you guys in a minute but that chair we are actually getting rid of it because it's a plastic chair and i want a white ends chair or maybe a pinkish one and it's that specific chair that actually Ilina Rebeokuta. I hate it in a real kuta and one thing that we're actually going to do with this wall is we are painting it right and i'm so excited about it i can't wait to do that uh painting video with you guys and then when you like just move kidogo i also have another plant it's um a snake plant and i got that for 100 kenyan shillings it's still the details are still on that video and then on top here i have my car screen uh, that one I also got it from Luduli, actually from the same person that referred me. When uh, you refer where to buy this system, you will refer where to buy this screen. Yeah, in case you are um, interested on the on the prices and everything, I'm so willing to tell you guys. Just drop a comment down below, and I'll actually respond i actually respond to all my comments moving to this side um sorry about that moving to this side it's my coach uh it's actually a three-seater coach that i had customized from a local fundi and he actually did like a really really nice job i was so excited with the end result but i was a little bit disappointed with one thing the cushions and the cushions with the pillows i don't know what they're actually called these ones is it they are so heavy you guys yeah ni sijui kama alijaza hizo vitu zenyeonekana ndani but it's like extremely extremely heavy ai and then like they don't leave like enough room for you to even sit like they have actually occupied like a lot of space but regardless i really really love it it's a three seater but was made to look like a two seater and then on that as sorry sorry about these two pillows I actually had them thrifted you guys <laughs> one more time thrifting doing that thing i thrifted this from a local shop uh easy to cousin your pillows uh pillowcases rags all that and then i thrifted this cover from thing twice and then i went to a shop and had them customize the like make me ionini and dani you get it yeah and then i actually you guys he pillowcase, I actually thrifted it for 100 Kenyan shillings. Imagine, I also think, I think he paid 100 Kenyan shillings. So, your insert, though, it was quite expensive, it was 350 shillings. So, imagine, he pillow 450 shillings. Now, uko online, hala, uko online, tajuju. Then, pia he, in Skumbuki, I think it was 100 shillings, and then the insert was, I think he had a hija 350. This Cathro blanket was a little bit expensive. I also thrifted it for, I guess, 1,500 Kenyan shillings. And then I also have, like, some sockets over there. I haven't connected this socket yet to my TV. Then there's another socket there that has my TV guard and one that I is connected to my extension. So, yeah. Moving. On top there is my curtains. Curtains plug easily, kama kawaida. Isli is like the plug for curtains. If you want good curtains, just go to Isli. You will really, really find like very nice curtains. So I got those ones, Kitambo Kidogo. I we actually have a video on like my previous channel about those curtains. Moving to this side, we have this chair that I was telling you guys needs to go. This chair actually needs to go. And a tripod. I was filming a video that will probably be up uh, over the weekend. Today is Thursday. And then this chair is the one we're replacing. I love to have it here because Hapa, I barely work from here unless I'm reading or I'm working. 
so yeah then down there is my extension and my kabambe charging <laughs> moving to this side is my two-seater uh seat it's also customized it was customized by a local fundi and usually maramob it's supposed to the idea usually is we don't have this capillary this one actually belongs to my bedroom i don't know what it's doing here this one is the one that is usually here or the bigger one like to create like an, an illusion of a uh, bigger seat kind of so yeah Okay, this one is my favorite seat you guys like I, I actually wanted to change my seats but i wasn't getting the energy to let this one go so i don't know so i think we are going to actually just keep the seats then down here is my mat uh plug easily i think it was going for 7000 kenyan shillings or 6500 i'm not so much sure about it we are not letting this one go maybe we should just have an alternative i've actually been thinking of buying another mat that i'll be exchanging nahi rag so sorry nahi mat so yeah that's actually it for the sitting room area i hope by now you people understand no study area plans tv we are actually another thing that we are actually currently saving up for is a tv stand i have one tv stand that i can't wait to buy and it looks so nice yeah, and then we're also going to buy a shelf and then we're also have going to have let me tell you guys quickly i think a plant here either a banana plant or a palm tree like a very long one and then mini frames over there and then over here we're going to have either a wall wall art gallery or um hanging shelves or mirrors going on here and then here i'm thinking of having mini frames also there's not enough space for aka plant here. If there was, we'll have a plant. Then aka, we are planning on having um, what do you call oh hanging shelves and then deco pieces and to plants on it. On this side, maybe a wall art gallery and then over here, we are actually thinking of also changing this table to a white table and then paint the walls white and then I'm also going to buy a shelf that I saw somewhere for like deco items and like maybe like a shelf for books. So that's what's going to happen. That's the transformation that's going to take, that's going to happen here so we are done with my living room area so now let's move to my kitchen so when you come evie we talk about sitting room you just like move here if you guys remember this is the kitchen and then this is the washroom then on my left here is my bedroom so heading to my kitchen <laughs> ah this is a space that we actually have to really 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 work on like eh we eat for kazi which i'm so excited actually about so what's happening here is when you come in you have these two boxes i actually have an um, unboxing video of uh these ones that we actually i don't know why i haven't uploaded that video i don't know i don't know why we have not uploaded that video just a box for that uh system and then the other one is for my microwave i didn't find a space to actually have them and i decided to just have them here so nothing is actually changing over here i think they're going to just stay here and then over here is my utensils this one is going hey you guys let me tell you a story i saw um a dish rack a dish rack that was so pretty but guess how much it was going for five thousand kenyan shillings and i'm not dish rack here five thousand hey apana hey kiwalai but it was so pretty yani it was so pretty but i'm still looking for an alternative that is really really cheap maybe 1500 I think 1500 is not bad or maybe at a 2000 but 5000 that's like on the extreme end it has my plates has my the combe and then over here if you have my it was a kosha vyombo over there so have a pink or whatever and then this one is going what's happening here i'm also eyeing a very nice shopping board from marbles kitchen style it's so pretty i know you people want to laugh at it imagine chopping board i madam so we are actually changing the chopping board and in Eliana kwa Mabel kitchen style is actually I think 800 Kenyan shillings so I really don't mind getting that. So this is going all these two plastics are actually going 
Yeah, that's actually going. I'm thinking of replacing them with something better. Kwanza hii, there's also something I saw online. But pole pole too, we will get there. Then over here, we have enough storage. One thing I appreciate about this kitchen is that it has enough storage. Like, there's too much storage for everything. We have a lot of cabinets down here. It has, like, my essentials. And then, you have this thing. And then, curtains. Curtains, one more time. Plug is easily. And then, you have my dispenser. It's a tabletop dispenser. It's actually broken over here. It's when you are moving out. And, um... Yeah, this one I got it Kitambo from a local supermarket. I think it was going for is it twenty five sikumbuki twenty five hundred or three thousand? I'm not so sure. I think somewhere there. It appeared actually thirty five hundred. So if you want a budget dispenser, this is the dispenser to go for. I've actually had this for quite some time and I really really love it. Then over here we have my kettle. Yeah. Worst part of my kitchen happening even my friend hates <laughs> hates yeah i must be in a way to a gas naive meza but we will start to talk to so over here nothing serious going on my gas because the gas in each are key i need to replace it okay my gas okay i store my bitungu there now my lemons and everything moving to this side um i have my microwave i actually got that from quick mart and it was on offer so i was able to bag it for just going for eleven thousand, and then it was on offer for nine thousand and ninety five. so yeah i was able to get that for nine thousand and ninety five. and then fridge i uh, also got that from a local supermarket quick mart one more time and i got this for i guess 28 29 000. So yeah, and then Hapoju, um, Hapoju, we have my cabinet. I don't know what was happening with whoever was constructing this house. Mbona mtu wa eke ni niju hivi. Like, saka mami singe kwa mrefu. That friend of mine that actually keeps telling me, anaito Aida, keeps telling me to do away with this. Hafi kange Hapoju. So anytime I want to punish that girl, I have to tell her to just come and do something. Yeah, she will never get it. I think anatusha nanga hapa. <laughs> Oi, not cool. Anyways, I don't say in case you're watching this. And then after that, it has nothing serious. Um, like this other side has my extra glasses that don't fit. Okay. Then Hapaju doesn't have anything. Like it has my uh cooking oil, ungaya uji. I love uji. And then tea leaves or uh, whatever you pressing spices. Chumvi, all that, and then Ukoju also has like my extra shopping. Yeah, so oh, my aluminium foil, and then some bread from Quick Mart. I actually love this bread. Like, I'm not a fan of bread, but these ones I usually love them. So I think that's it for my kitchen. Actually, before we moved out, this kitchen is a little bit no, not so spacious. Like, just look at it. It's not like so spacious. I had like a very big kitchen. Like, it was. Double yeah, he like that house had like a really nice kitchen. Ilikuwa kubwa and then pia the bathroom was like really really big. So yeah, that's basically it for the kitchen. You come in, uh this whatever utensils, sink, water, um whatever that's happening here, gas, my table, microwave, fridge. So changes going on in here. Not pretty sure if I want to replace the dispenser. I think I'll just retain it. Yeah, and then uh, what I want to do is buy those uh, cute baskets to have these things like organized, like a kitchen, and then also change my spice tracks, like easy spices to really pretty jars, and then have them labeled, like they, they really, really look nice. So, yeah. Then keep a very nice spice rack. I'm going to buy it and then maybe organize some stuffs over there. And then maybe some frames, some kitchen frames, maybe or maybe not. We can choose to ignore. And then maybe some hubs over here. Just, just maybe, just maybe. Then when you come from my kitchen, I think you already now understand. You like move here. Yeah? Like so no, no. Like when you come from the kitchen, you have to unenda. And then that you're either going outside, you can come to my bedroom, or you can come to my sitting room, or you can go to my washroom. You'll have to excuse the lighting, because the lighting in my bathroom is not the best. So, yeah. So, bathroom, nothing major going on. I think I really, wa I, I really want to work on this bathroom, like, more than any other part of this house. Like, 
iko na vitu mingi that has issues first of all the the tiling at oki scrubage they never really just get so clean like having a rangi to extreme you can realize kwa corners whoever constructed aliwacha kama to sandish or sijui nini here my shower cap shower that we're actually replacing cuz that i funny i moved into this house ikiwa sijui and the first time i showered ikachomeka so i'm actually thinking of replacing it this car towel holder here you can notice in metokana i want to fix this we have a safe light eh that's me oh hi hi <laughs> Uh, safe light we are also not working also i found it kama haifanyi so actually nilikuwa najua haifanyi so see me i was just cleaning my bathroom hey sema kupitisha mkono hapo juu sema shock hey you guys i was shocked hey karibu yani hata nianguke chini and then here that's me this is we have a soap holder currently has no soap cuz i use my shower gel then he imetokana sasa mimi hata sijui yani i just have issues then you have a sink where you can brush your teeth and then mirror to maybe do your makeup or anything then over here we have a tissue holder some air wick to keep this place fresh actually just do something with it and then you have my omo or washing powder whatever way you choose to call it my toilet cleaner which is actually going i saw a very pretty toilet cleaner also like i really want it and then i think i've actually been looking out for like washroom toilet products for i said <laughs> for products for my bathroom and my toilet cuz i'm actually thinking of like flipping this bathroom like kabisa kabisa cuz i enjoy my showers and i want to enjoy my showers in a very nice place then up here has nothing to us my toilet cleaning whatever as shampoo conditioner shower gel toilet like a freshener body scrub those brushes now kama wewe unajua those brush yako iko hapa na uishi kwa nyumba i'll use it to tengeneza my edges you want to see you use those brushes at those <laughs> so in case you have your those brushes you tell me before i use it to tengeneza my edges hey then down here we have our washroom so that's basically it for the bathroom and then you also have like your bowl basically for the bathroom my products what you also adding to this space is, is a product is in a talk up thinking of getting like a shelf not sure if i want to get a shelf like a stand for here um, i want to get this like a command kaukuta not so sure i'm still actually weighing options ama um, ile this one yenye you hang over kwa ini ni ika kitu ya shower so i'm thinking of a either of them and then yeah just do something do something over here Then you also have like that cadre then when you come out a kamat this mat <laughs> was actually what I need to pay you story tanifanya nilie and then when you come out of the bathroom you can go to my bedroom so for my bedroom uh, first thing you see dirty clothes ah you guys i have a lot of laundry that needs to be done like these things zote ziko hapo are dirty hakuna hata moja safi Yeah, I'm actually spotting something that I was looking for in my closet kumbe ilikuwa hapa. Okay. So when you walk in the first thing you see is that and then next thing is my bed. So this bed I also had it customized from a local fundi and this was going for 10,000. 10,000 yes. 10,000 and then maybe siju kama nili bargain because i'm sure i'm always bargaining maybe i bargained to 9,000 then for the duvet duvet was going for 1,700 i also thrifted this one that big pillow customized this capillo you see this pillow this ka sausage pillow i got it with the capillo that is in the living room yenye nafanana hizi curtains i got each for 500 of them somewhere in kawawendani ka, ka, kawa ako katikati ya kawawendani and give the right 45 there's a place kuna mafundi hapo wanatengenezanga vitu and then you have your socket over there charge my phone and then this one is like my lights off lights on my bed switch then that mosquito eh hey, mosquitoes akiwa lai wewe as like mosquitoes just make you sleep so uncomfortable and i don't love nets so i don't have an alternative that was like the best alternative i would get then over there curtains curtains definitely the plug is easily like if you want curtains at an affordable price and then you have like a variety of um 
patterns, texture, whatever to choose from, Isle is the plug. Moving on to this side is my drawers. I actually appreciate that there's enough storage, like drawers, enough space. So for the drawers, um, I think we already did a closet tour and <coughs> they fit all my clothes, like easy zote and even zanyazikuapa zikiyoshua, they'll still fit. So here I have my clothes and then my sash modeling now <laughs> anyways and then down here we already did a video about upper so i don't want to actually waste my time over here that's the entire situation going on some books that i explained in that video why they are here i'll also leave a link then my today to my day-to-day -day products my innerwares and whatever my these two are my school backpacks and then using handbags and they are my handbags then this kamat was also thrifted like every, almost everything is actually thrifted this was thrifted for wait wait 2000 2000 this was thrifted for 2000 kenyan shillings quiet bedroom there's no enough space to actually you know like make over the entire space maybe frames maybe i don't know because there's not even space for like a bedside table because it's a queen convenience kufungai and i actually think that's the reason why they had sliding like doors because Ukifungwa sasa hivi, like there's no space, you get. So, yeah. Then I also wanted to show you guys my mattress. I actually invested in a very, very nice mattress. Like, this is the mattress. It's really big. And Yani, this is one of the best investments that I ever did because I came to realize that you people, when you, you deserve like a good rest, when you have like a very, very bad day, you actually deserve some nice rest. And I didn't have like a really nice mattress. So I decided to invest in this mattress that I also bought from a local supermarket. It's um, it's Maharaja and it was going for 12,000. Yeah, it was going for 12,000 Kenyan shillings and it actually has a warranty. Kitu ingine sina ni bed sheets. So you people mkenda bed sheet shopping, please call me. Because <laughs> I actually had like a smaller bed and then when I bought this one, so I no longer use like my previous bed sheets. And then one thing I also want is a mattress cover because yeah, I want to protect this mattress. I really, really invested in buying that mattress. So I really need to protect it. So done from here. Okay, this video is going to be long. Done from here, worst part of my house. Up and that you are escaping from Blangoyenje. And then now you remember like do you remember like up and down that's the main door and then so not the main door lango and then and then plain lango angel so this is like the wash area you have a tap over there then my shoes are here we need to get a bigger shoe rack i think and then my windows are kufongo my window emerging case my gender which has actually never gone then my cab room and my karata se uchafu don't mind the dirtiness going on here too i don't know but anyway, I hate this place, but I don't hate it. I feel like if we actually put a lot of effort to make over this place, it will like really, really look nice, which I think maybe with some time, I'll do it. Sometime means manze mans. Eh, pesa wewe. So, yeah. Okay, guys, that's going to be it for today's video. I really, really appreciate whoever has watched this till the end. So in case um, you have any queries, please drop a comment down below and I'll be so glad to to respond and uh, in case you have a suggestion of what maybe i should do away with or what i should add i'm really open to suggestions like sana 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 please suggest anything that we should do away with or anything that we should add and i really really appreciate it thank you so much guys for actually watching please subscribe like aki 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 well, yeah, aki please subscribe we need to get to where our previous channel was at, and I know I'm really putting the effort, but you people are not subscribing. Like my analytics is in an nation that people that actually watch my content, 85% of them are not subscribed. 15% of them are subscribed. So our uh, 85% Mbonaham subscribe. Please subscribe. It's really free. All you have to do is press the button there, like the red button written subscribe. It's very free, absolutely free. So you guys, until next time, bye.